Well, good evening, everyone, and welcome here to the Launchpad and our live launch coverage of SpaceX Starlink 12-19, set to launch from Space Launch Complex 40 at Cape Canaveral Space Force Station in Florida. If it's your first time here, though, welcome. My name's Zach. I'm the founder and host here at the Launchpad, and here at TLP, it's our mission to inform and inspire the explorers of tomorrow because we believe that space is better together, and we're glad to have you joining us live here tonight. We are 75% go for launch with today's weather. SpaceX is currently targeting a liftoff time of 1.24 a.m. local time, 5.24 a.m. UTC, with just one minute left in today's launch window, so we're basically an instantaneous launch window here tonight. Tonight's Falcon 9 booster is booster 1077, going for its 20, excuse me, going for its 21st flight on a 35-day turnaround for today's mission. This booster previously supported Crew-5, GPS Space Vehicle 6, Amarasat ISF-2, CRS-28, Intelsat G-37, NG-20, TD-7, and 13 previous Starlink missions. SpaceX's autonomous drone ship just read the instructions is stationed downrange, ready to recover today's booster in the Atlantic Ocean. Now, if for any reason they weren't able to lift off here today, they do have backup opportunities opening on Wednesday, June 4th, starting at 12.02 a.m. Eastern Time. One moment, please. I am just seeing... Let's see here. Is this... We might have just actually had a change on the schedule based on their website, but not on an official update yet. So bear with me. So we navigate this in real time. Uh, we have had, I believe, a delay for today's launch. Yes, they have scrubbed tonight's launch. We are officially scrubbed for this evening. SpaceX is now officially targeting no earlier than 12.29 a.m. Eastern Time on Tuesday, June 3rd, uh, to launch Starlink 12-19. They do have backup opportunities running till 4.29 a.m. Eastern uh, on Tuesday. If needed, they do have additional opportunities on Wednesday, June 4th. But uh, that is how, uh, how it happens there, uh, folks. We are officially scrubbed for this evening. Which is interesting since the weather looks decently well here, uh, but uh, just in that time that we did our intro, uh, we have officially scrubbed tonight's launch attempt. Now, as always, if you want to stay up to date on the latest of the launch schedule, you can head over to tlpnetwork.com, click on the launch button. That is where you can see the updated uh, schedules of all of the missions as it happens, uh, as we continue to bring you full coverage of so many incredible missions happening this year. Taking a look at the launch schedule at this point, it means we do have a Rocket Lab launch scheduled for June 2nd, Starlink on two Starlinks on June 3rd, we're counting down to the launch of Sirius XM-10 on Falcon 9 a little bit later this month, as well as the SpaceX Axiom Space Crew 4 mission to the International Space Station with Peggy Whitson. We've got the second Project Kuiper launch, a launch out of India, a launch out of Japan, and so much more happening around the world this month. So make sure you've engaged that subscribe button and to make sure you never miss another live launch coverage. And join us over on the TLP Discord. That's where our community hangs out in between streams. And we would love to see you there. But for now, that is going to do it from our TLP Canada studio. My name is Zach. Thanks for joining us for this quick coverage of a scrubbed attempt of launch of Starlink 12-19. But for now, that's going to do it for us here tonight. My name is Zach, and we will see you next time because space is better together. Good night, and love you, Papa.